Good morning, everyone. It is a few days later, or maybe a week later after you guys see this video. Um, but uh, I was up here yesterday and I basically finished what we were doing in the last video. So this little section right here on the corner, Hopefully you guys can tell uh, with the sun being in the way, but um, basically from the tree line there over to the building pad there, I cleared all that back maybe 30 feet or so, so we could easily fit three or four cars there. And um, let me get, let me show you guys, let me walk over here and show you guys what I'm doing today. So with all those trees, there's probably six of them that I cleared. There's still a few more on top of this pile. But uh, I piled them all up on this pile and then I was like, man, some of these are pretty decent sized trees for, uh, for firewood. And so I decided before I left yesterday that I was gonna just go ahead and bring the chainsaws today and I'm gonna process them. So essentially cut them into, you know, eight foot sticks, however many eight foot sticks we can get per tree. Uh, and then pile the rest of them onto the, um, the pile so it can be burned, cut off the stump um, so it can be burned and then uh, I'm gonna show you guys the new area that I I haven't made it yet. We're gonna make it today We have to move all of the logs from the pond area to the new spot that I uh, I found or made or whatever you want to call it uh, That way my guy can start digging the pond and uh, get it all out of his way And then also it'll be out of the way. I couldn't figure out where I was gonna put all the logs uh, Because if I put them in the trail, then I'm not gonna be able to pick them up and move them and get to them because uh, the trail's not wide enough. So anyway, I'm gonna show you guys that. Gotta go get on the excavator. But real quick, I got a few treated boards so I can put underneath our uh, new log piles. Got the chainsaws and gloves and stuff in there. But yeah, gonna go get the excavator and bring it over here and we're gonna start cutting up these few trees. guys so this is what's gonna happen so got the chainsaw I'm gonna set you guys and then we're just gonna pile them probably over here for now and then once I've got all these uh, uh, cut up then we're going to move them to the new spot so yeah let's go ahead and get started so just got all these done there's a couple more in there but uh i don't think that they were big enough to um to go through it but anyway some of them i did get eight foot and 16 foot pieces off of so 
right here we got one two three four uh four or five 16 foot pieces and then we've got probably the same amount maybe three or four uh eight foot pieces so you know hey not bad i mean not a ton of firewood but uh definitely better than just burning it um so now what i'm gonna do i'm gonna put the chainsaw up and then we're gonna grab those uh those treated pieces of wood so we're gonna go ahead and grab some of these logs and just start bringing them at least a little closer
probably need to clear that out just a little bit more because I mean the last 30 feet was just I mean everything was getting hung up and stuck and wasn't good so
dirty. If I put these small ones up top, it's just going to be rolling all over the place. So. guys that's gonna be the end of this video um, I've got just a couple more of the eight foot section uh, logs but um, this is where the pile was so uh, as you guys can see this is the second um, stack that we did this is the first stack that we did and this was the new stack that we cut up this morning at the beginning of the video and um, this will probably be for next year this will be for possibly this winter here that's a lot of wood and this pile here as you guys can see some of this stuff is really big um, you know I mean it's not the biggest tree in the world but it's definitely gonna be some good wood and uh, it's just gonna be used for campfires so we should be good but I'm um, gonna end this video here and uh, next video I'm going to finish taking those logs and not too sure what else but um, whatever we have to do we will do it. So throw down in the comments below and let me know what you guys think and uh, hit the like button, subscribe, and uh, put a comment down below because it, uh, it really helps. So peace.